back out. Part two in the big brother house. No, that's day two, isn't it? Well, it is. That's not day two. Ah, shut up, man. Anyway, we're on another wild camp. It's not really that wild, but it is wild, if you get me. This nice beach here, lovely white sandy beach. Um, in a little hobbit hole. It's really windy tonight. It's a total contrast to last night. It's so windy now. We're just wanting it to be a bit less. <laughs> the weather can't win. We can't win. But we're getting a little uh, barbecue table going. And it's up off the, off the grass, it's not burning the grass. So that's all right. We'll just keep an eye on it. Watch out for, um, what do you call it? Sparks flying. Should be all right though. It's green grass, it's not too dry. We'll put a bit of water down. Yeah, should be all right. Um, what else? A chair, a little table, a good water source. Good little spot. The absolute far north of Scotland we are. This up here, don't know if you can see it, this is a zip line. It's not it's not operational today. I says, should we go on the zip line? I says, yeah. And when we get on it, I'll go on it right and it'll go I'll be running along the beach and then back up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not that fat. <laughs> Maybe I am. Anyway, at Stack Polly, right, I found a pair of sunglasses just lying there. Somebody's obviously lost them. So, my email address is in the description. If these are your sunglasses, you recognise them, you lost them at Stack Polly, get in touch and I'll send them back to you. Um, I'll give you one month. If you don't reply within a month, the mine. And they're really, really expensive as well. They're very expensive. You tell me what make they are. I looked them up on um, on the Google search. Absolutely, three hundred pounds worth of sunglasses. I'm just borrowing them at the minute. So if they're yours, get in touch, and I'll send them back to you. No Mickey take us because I see right through you. Mark's just away up there for. Um, uh, gone for the food eh? he's got the food in the back of his he's got like a little refrigerated box and we're gonna get that get a barbecue on it's gonna be a better night than last night last night was a disaster i've only got a few beers a couple of ipas and then we've got this and yeah punk ipa i'm gonna have that now well, that's it it's good nice it's, uh, it's flat in there that's the only flat bit I could find. This is all slopey as out, but I had a lie down and it's flat. So yeah, it's been a good trip this. So we um, we went out on Saturday last week, me and Leanne. And we had uh, two nights in a hotel, just to spoil ourselves, it was her birthday. Happy birthday. I might have forgot to wish her happy birthday, probably. I'm just joking. And we had two nights in a hotel, and then we had a wild camp, which I didn't film. Um, I could put a little clip in of that. We did the sunset. We had the sunset, and then night lapse, which was, it was all right to start with, and then the cloud came. And that was it, really. Didn't film anything else. It was a lovely place, lovely. We didn't want to share it. It's a beautiful beach. We'll go back. This is a lovely beach as well, mate. So that's it. We'll just crack on. Oh yeah, and then I had to drop her off at home because she had commitments. And then I came back up to, uh, I went to Fort William. I stayed over at Glen Nevis campsite, which are here at campsites. So you can imagine what that was like. It was all right, just don't like campsites. And then I came up to Ullapool and met Mark on the way. What are the chances of that? Just met him in a lay-by. I pulled in for a natural break. And there he was. <laughs> Unbelievable. Meet. 
So I'm going to crack on. We've come down on the beach for a little wander. Gone for a ratch. Robert Bruce's stone. The tents are up there. Where's Robert Bruce's stone? Yeah. Not another one. Yeah. <laughs> <I am. laughs> How many stones has Robert the Bruce put? <laughs> Lots. Everywhere you go. Look at this beach. Wow. Man, this is nice. And when the tide's up, the water is turquoise blue because of it. This is like a little bit that traps the sea that comes on a high tide. How does it get oh, up? Oh, there's like a little channel around the back there. Yeah, it must channel through. Yeah, I think this beach is a bit high for the tide. It's beautiful, man. It's absolutely beautiful. Uh, it's a big sandbar on it, but it's not a not an underwater one. Nice man. What a place. What a place. Mark stuck about a million photos. I kind of blame him, like. Oh, some place. Where the rocks are formed like that, rather than like that. wind better than working <laughs> sitting in the house where is it? it's uh, quarter to seven at night I'm just trotting around doing this <laughs> ah. What a place. Absolutely stunning. Just crystal clear water. Look at the sand. There's no rocks. There's no seaweed. It's just amazing. Well worth a visit. Aye. So, we're down among the burgers. Look at them. Big old proper butcher's burgers, them. From uh, Scurry. Scurry, aye. Yeah, yeah. From Scurry. Scurry. We're from a Scurry. <laughs> aye. Big up Scurry. The burgers are lovely. Bye. Well, I hope they are. I'm tasting them, anyway. If they didn't stick to it. Oh, they're sticking. Stick out, oh, we'll, we'll, my we'll, we'll get there. I'm gonna film this because this could be interesting. This is a this is an operation save. Oh, this is not happening. Nah, you need a you need a, 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 a trust me. 
Ah, we've got movement. Scooty burgers. Hey. Disaster or oh, disaster averted. Good one. Good move. Oh, oh yeah. I like your moves. I like that. Not your moves. Oh, your moves. Uh, yes. That's it. That's another one as well. I remember that. That's fucking hot. Right, so how's your trip been anyway? Oh, it's been fucking absolutely fantastic. It's been hilarious, isn't oh, it? Yeah? It's been brilliant. <laughs> we have had no laughs, right? We've had no crack. No crack at all. We've just we've, we've kind hardly, of just sat and stared out to yeah, see. We've hardly spoke to each other. Um, no drink, guys. Like no, none. It's been gash. No pubs about. It's yeah. been absolutely gash. <laughs> we shout out to Eddie. Yeah, Eddie, Eddie, Scott's well camper. Yeah. Look forward to our next camp. Look forward to our next camp. We've wound him up so much this yeah, weekend, yeah. haven't we? Look at us. Look at us. We're out. We're doing this. But isn't he doing like a massive walk soon? Yeah, he's got the Southern Upland Way. Aye. Uh, October, I think they're doing it. Aye, well, that'll be it. He can, he can get us back. He can get his revenge. Eddie's revenge. That's down your way, see? So you can meet them for a night. Oh, it's not far, like. Saying that, it's still about 150 mile away. Is it? Aye, uh, it is quite far, actually. Aye, uh, it is. Anyway, we're going to get these done. The Scooty Burgers. We've got other stuff as well. And you see this sauce here? <laughs> Stay away from me. <laughs> Mark's terrified of this sauce for some reason. I didn't get it. I don't. It's a irrational fear of Heinz bacon here. So <laughs> I'm wearing it. It's got no to do with the fact it's all over his face and in his car. It's Here, everywhere. Have you tasted this? <laughs> everywhere. I said, yeah, Mark. Have a, have a little try of this. Right, put a little bit on your finger. I squeezed it and it just went bash all over him. All over them. Anyway, you had to be there. You had to be there. You had to be there. So we're here. Then we're having a great time. So well, that's it, really. We'll come back when we're really, really drunk. It'll be in about twenty minutes. So. Uh, <laughs> it's actually now. No, the, the burger. So we just watched the sun go down over there, and we have had our burgers, pork chops, all kinds. Had a good night. Brilliant night. Hasn't it been nice? Much better than that last night up there with the midges. Mind saying that, if it hadn't been for the midges, last night would have been mint. Oh, the, the view, eh? Would have been amazing. It was good, but, yeah, you know, the midges. But look at this. Oh, we're on the very, very far northern tip of Scotland. Oh. Cape Wrath is just up that way. I didn't realise Cape Wrath was so far away. I know, I didn't realise it was just here. So I've got a, um, Mark lives in Perth, so he's got what, four, four and a half hours? Uh, I'd be about four and a half, five hours, yeah. I've got an eight hour drive the Mark. Eight hours. <laughs> 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 so you, you can't, you, <laughs> I'm going to be, I think I may be breaking that up actually. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking fly. Eight hours Places drive. In the world quicker oh, than that. Man. Honestly, are you could. Yeah. You could get to America in less than eight hours. <laughs> Anybody want to send a plane? I'll take it. Aye, but anyway. So it's yeah. A long way less up there. It's, yeah, it's, it's worth not it. It's a straight though. road, does it? It's worth it. You don't do it all the time, so. No. Right, so we're just gonna uh, we're gonna have another couple of beers, chill out, and just listen to some music and this. Just imagine the Stone Rose is playing now. Obviously you can't play it because of copyright. Yeah. Put your own stone music over that. Rose's music. Oh, I don't know. Pink Floyd. I think I might be drunk. Anything. Any music over that. What's well, Hawkwind? Hawkwind. Hawkwind. Oh, that's me. Trippy. Hawkwind is a good band. I, I got a silver machine. Mm. I do things with it. <laughs> you just don't want to um, see <laughs> that. This is it. This is how the night ends. This is how the week 
the weekends because uh, yeah I've got to head back home tomorrow it's an eight hour drive <laughs> to get back home no me it'll probably take about ten hours but you know that's okay I don't mind because I've had a great week great to have a week off great first half of the week with Leanne in a great second half of the week with Mark which was totally unplanned but just as well I know him and I think he's alright might be alright but yeah we've had a good night we've had a really good night tonight last night was midgy hell but tonight it's been really good made up for it Come back in the mum. Do a little bit more after this. But for now, oh, I've got the really hiccups, hiccups with burps. So this is the morning after the aurora, did you see it? And we were asleep, but it was there like. So we've left no trace there. This is where we had the fire, as you can see. Is that, that's not even burnt ground. That's just a bit of green grass, like that. So that's where we had the seat and the table. All gone. Mark's just finishing off there. I've got my stuff ready to go. Up there. And then we're off. Following the North Coast 500 route. <clears throat> we've done about the North Coast 200. Oh, we've done most of it. I recommend doing that drive if you get the chance. It's lovely. The scenery's amazing, isn't it? Oh, it's just different. It's really different. Incredible. Never been up this part before. I will definitely want to come back. And look at us, top of Scotland in t-shirts. I know. Yeah. Right, so we'll cut it there. Unless anything interesting happens, that'll be it. Hope you've enjoyed watching this little adventure, micro adventure. If not, I don't really care. <laughs> Hi. <laughs>